everybody, welcome back to my channel. <clears throat> Today we'll be reviewing a, oh, it's not a hot sauce, it's made by a hot sauce company, but it's a condiment. Today from Melinda's, we have her black pepper ketchup. Sounded pretty good. I ordered it off of Amazon along with her habanero ketchup, I believe it was, but that's for another video. We're going to review this one today. And we're going to get right into the back. It says, inspired by fire. You won't find high fructose corn syrup in our ketchup. Instead, we use real cane sugar and freshly ground black peppercorns to craft a zesty ketchup with a peppery flavor. One try and you'll never use plain old ketchup again. So we'll get into the ingredients. And they are sugar, vinegar, water, tomato paste, glucose, salt, onion, lime juice, spices, which is pepper and garlic, xanthan gum, passion fruit, okay, citric acid, ascorbic acid, artificial flavors, which are clove and cinnamon, and clove and cinnamon, artificial flavors, artificial clove and artificial cinnamon, okay, all right, now it's going to be kind of hard to see the consistency, but you know what ketchup consistency is, but, uh, let's, uh, get this baby open. Has more of more of a um, how can I put this more of a real smell than regular than other ketchup brands. This is what it looks like there. So let's give this a pour. Oh, I'm sorry. Give it a squeeze. On our Johnny Scoville spoon. Chase the heat spoon. Definitely get yourself one. JohnnyScoville.com. Alright, here's the squeeze. Try not to get it to go everywhere. Oh, okay. Well, there you have it. That's a spoonful there. So, from Melinda's, her black pepper ketchup. Here we go. Definitely tastes better with real sugar in it. A little bit of spice. Well, I should say the pepper, the black pepper. Oh. Oopsie. You know what? I'm going to do this a safer way since I'm the only one who uses it. You can't stick the spoon in there, so we're just going to do it this way so I don't wear it. There we go. I don't know if you can actually see the black pepper flex in there. Man. There's a very tangy, zesty ketchup, and I love it. Okay. So, my thoughts. Obviously, there's no heat because there's nothing really hot in it. Other than the black pepper, and black pepper's not hot. Um, I get the sugar, the vinegar, the tomato paste. I get to taste the onion, the pepper, the garlic. You get a touch of the clove and the cinnamon. Didn't really get the lime juice, but it's good. Like I say, no heat. Um, flavor, I give it a seven and a half out of ten. It's definitely a recommended. Definitely recommend to go get it. So there you go, Melinda's black pepper ketchup. Say I found it on Amazon, I think it was like 7 bucks for a 14 ounce bottle, which for that stuff you're going to pay a little more, but it's well worth it. It's very delicious. So, hope you enjoyed this review. Like, comment, subscribe, share, do whatever you want with it. I don't care. See you next time.